today, and we hope to continue participating with them in the future. Um, the Human Flood Federation of America is a nonprofit advocacy organization based here in Washington, D.C. We represent the end users of uh, floor products, um, and we're basically we champion their rights. Um, we want to make sure that the products are safe, um, that they have accessibility to the products, that they're affordable, and that they're, they're available. Um, we really want to express our concerns um, regarding the ongoing record of flood safety compliance failures at the American Red Cross today. Um, the Division of Blood Services at the American Red Cross forms an integral link to our national blood supply. Um, the current blood collection system thrives on the ability of skilled workers to provide clean, safe blood and blood derived products to laboratories. Um, infusions of clotting factor derived from plasma and blood donations is used in the treatment of bleeding disorders such as hemophilia and vulnerable Bronx disease. Um, the individuals that we represent that are affected by bleeding disorders rely on the availability of safe and efficacious clotting factor concentrates for their very lives. Um, blood collection at the Red Cross continues to be a subject to a 17-year-old consent decree stemming from federal court action. Um, the nature of this civil matter raises serious concerns for our community and the people that we represent. The Red Cross continues to de de demonstrate a pattern of behavior which seems to place costs ahead of the health and well-being of both workers and the end users of blood the products and blood products. Um, for HFA, the blood safety, um, the supply is, remains one of our highest priorities. Um, to this end, we call on all institutions such as the Red Cross serving users of blood products to really place safety um, ahead of cost. Our community really experiences dire consequences when the shadow of cost weighs too heavily on the public health outcomes. We really encourage the Red Cross to recommit itself to maintaining safe and clean and helpful presence inside America's larger health infrastructure. Um, additionally, the, the HFA, we urge the FDA to really work with the Red Cross to bring it to, into full compliance with the federal laws and regulations that are aimed at ensuring the safety of our nation's